here's an addendum, Crouton Ramones, how's the math? Talking about how we're not going to do consecutive lessons. We're not going to do uh, the same thing for every kid because even in, if you've got siblings, the kids are not the same. So it's not. But having said that, you can level the playing field using these blocks. You'll see that I, uh, you know, I just showing on my blog where I have the six-year-old, the seven-year-old, and the nine-year-old, and we're doing the same lesson. But it's not. Uh, Technically, it's not the same because f it's still uh, designed for, like, I'll give the younger kid easier, smaller problems, and I'll give the older kid, quote-unquote, bigger, larger number problems where there's more counting involved, even in that same lesson. But the concept is the same. That's what levels the playing field is the fact that it's concept-based teaching based teaching. <laughs> Too lazy to write it all up. See, I could have some graphics put in later, maybe. So all the concepts, the, when it's, the concepts are the same, the six-year-olds can keep up with the 12-year-olds. And I've had great stories where I had some pesky football playing 15-year-old, uh, 16-year-old boys, a couple of, well, that was actually a long time ago, it was like seven or eight years ago, maybe nine years ago. Right, it was before my sons were born, so maybe ten years ago where they were unable to, because they just enacted, uh, they enacted this rule that you can't play football if you have an F. So if you got an F in math, you can't play, right? And they were like, oh, we can't do this, we can't learn this algebra, blah, 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 I hate this math, and they hate me, and they hate their parents for sending them to me, and that, right? So one day, I brought a 10-year-old girl in, a little skinny 10-year-old, cute little girl, sat her down, and she was doing all the algebra, that they were supposed to be doing, right? Just for that one lesson, humbled those boys, and I'm, a couple of the parents were like, that wasn't very nice, that was actually kind of cruel. <laughs> I was like, well, I guarantee you, now they have motivation, <laughs> right? right? Because now they can see that a 10-year-old girl can do the math that they're doing, and they have this whole macho thing, they're football players on top of that, right? Okay, right. Right. so like I said, concept-based teaching, it just, that just levels the playing field. Okay, that's the, but at the same time, you don't want to do it the same way for every kid all the time, every day, right? Because you've got individual children, individual thinking, individual learning styles, so individual lessons. And that's why I'm so resistant to making a curriculum that's this, 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 this. Okay, Crouton Ramones, how's the math for more? <laughs>